I don't have a read for Miss Coco Montrese this week because the episode was boring. I thought with how big Coco Montrese's mouth is backstage at Divas that she definitely was going to win that mini challenge. Bobby, Bobby, did you see uh, that Coco Montrese? She was on Untuck. And I just loved it. She let that little boy have it. She sent him home crying. They woke up the beast. No, really, they woke up the beast. When Coco Montrese was dressed up as LaShawn Beyond, I thought, oh my God, there's a new character. She could be Tinky Winky, the gay Teletubby. I was so scared when Coco Montrese went, don't try it, little boy, don't try it, little boy. It scared me. I mean, I felt like I was actually there. Many the times she's told me that, I don't care, I'm a woman. I don't know why Coco Montrese got so offended when Serena called her old. She is. Honey, the joke's on them. I'm on the billboard. All right, Coco Montrese. I tell you, honey, you are fabulous. You're making the Miss Scare Americas proud. And don't forget, I'm betting on you to win. Mwah. I love it when she was reading Serena. I love watching old people get riled up. Tonight, Coco Montrese lip synced on RuPaul's Drag Race to LaShawn Dion. She lip synced impeccably, flawlessly, and perfectly. It's a skill that she will be needing for later in the competition, I'm sure. Oh my God, Whitney, what did you say about Coco Montrese? She's so beautiful. Even Michelle's called her Patty LaBelle. Love you, Mama. Oh, I got so excited when I saw that they were doing the Rihanna number for the lip sync. I just wish Montrese would have been in it. Not that she deserved to be, but she's just such an incredible entertainer. She doesn't look like Rihanna, but she's a great dancer. Well, when Coco Montrese came down the runway wearing that football thing with all the feathers and all that, she looked like a member of KISS. Well, actually, she should be a member of her own group called KISS My Ass. You know, all kidding aside, I just really want to take a minute and say congratulations. I know this is a major point in your career right now, and I'm very proud of you. And I think you're going to go all the way. If not, you'll at least be in the top three. And although we've never met, I think I like you the most because you said you compare yourself to Vanessa Williams, and I love Vanessa Williams. You have no idea. So, Alyssa, I just want to say congratulations. And This is not Alyssa's video. <laughs> Make sure you tune in to RuPaul's Drag Race Season 5 to catch the one and only Coco Montrese starting January 28th. I don't care how much you dress Coco Montrese up, she's always going to look like E.T. to me.